from Bangkok. What do we got going on on here? What is oh, this? Yeah, I like actually, it. Okay, let's go over in the ringside cafe. Come. I just found someone who just came to Bangtao Muay Thai because of the Hickman brothers. Putin Scheiser. Hey guys, Pete here. Uh, this is a new series I want to put on on YouTube. We're here at Bangtao Muay Thai and I actually want to introduce you to a few of our customers, fighters, people who work here and tell you a little bit about them. And the most important question is how much do they pay to stay and live the dream life out here? So let's go over here. I see already one. Tizian. Tizian died today in my class. Tizian, can I, can I ask you a few questions? Of course, of course you can. Okay. Why do you come to Bangtao Muay Thai? Actually, uh, because I want to become an amateur fighter like in a better way. Maybe someday a pro, I think that the coach, the coaches will decide that. Mm. Come check this out, you know, this guy is very awesome. His training, I, I didn't do the count properly. So I thought like, okay, I really, I just want to die or I quit. He died, but I, he didn't quit. Didn't what are you doing for work? What is your job? My job is actually a security guard at the hospital in uh, Nuremberg. Oh, how long are you going to stay here? Uh, I'm going to stay here for 17 weeks, uh, 17 days. What does 17 days of holiday uh, cost you here? 15,000 baht are about how much euros? Yeah, euros? like 400. Like 400, 400, 400 bucks. Yeah. Imagine that, 400 bucks for accommodation, training every day and food. That's nothing, nothing. Okay. Is hey, awesome. Enjoy your stay. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you, brother. Okay, let's go over in the ringside cafe, come. I see some boys waiting there for us. Yo. Tizian, I talked to you already. He talked to me already. We're gonna introduce to our viewers the people from Bangtao. Harry. <laughs> No, Stuart, Stuart too. <laughs> I'm going to talk to both of you. We just want to show who comes here. And the most important question is, how much did you pay? So first of all, Harry, where are you from? I know you're not from England. You are no, from? I'm from Wales. Uh -huh. Wales. That is very important. Not England. Wales. Wales, that's the one, yeah. And you're here with your girlfriend, right? My girlfriend, yeah. How long are you going to stay? Here for one month. Yeah. Maybe a bit longer now, bit but longer. one month minimum. Yeah. Why Bangtao? Um, Truthfully, because of the Hickman brothers, really, and because the team that's around here. The Hickman brothers? Putin Scheiser. <laughs> no, no, originally I was going to go Tiger, but then I seen, you know, a lot of the coaches come from Tigers yeah, yeah, here. Yeah. The location as well, you know, 30 seconds from the beach. Yeah, that is awesome. Exactly, we're at beach up here. Now, you come for a good months. So would you share how much you pay, like just living cost, food, uh, training? Don't need to talk about the flight, but what did you pay? What, like how much training costs and that as well? Yeah, what do you or pay for one month? Like, train, you uh, go partying a lot? Not really, no. Okay, I, so no I there. think training was about 300 or 320 for the month in pounds mm. um, or 12,500 baht. In terms of living, accommodation, I don't know, maybe 600 baht a day on food. 600 and, baht, yeah. You know, a couple of drinks here and there, but that was it. So we got, let's say, 1,000 baht on food mm -hmm. for two of yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Yeah, yeah. That is yeah. Good. Maybe that a bit is more, maybe 1,200, but no more than that. Plus the trading, so, so what is that? We come into yeah. 1,500 pounds? I, yeah, I think I took out about 800 pounds for this month. But, yeah. Fuck, it's pretty good. I could do it cheaper as well, a lot mm. cheaper, but... Or could do more expensive, but... Of course, you can always piss money up the wall, right? Right, Stuart? Uh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> that is the good introduction for Stuart. Yeah, Stuart is here for a while already. We trained for, what, a yeah, month? We've been here, I've been here a month. Mm -hmm. Very interesting man. Stuart traveled a lot, uh, pretty much the whole world. Why Phuket? I played a wild card coming out here. I wasn't sure what to expect, but I wanted to sort of punctuate, put a full stop in life and uh, go to an island paradise and this looked like paradise from a distance and I'm happy I came. Awesome, awesome. Yeah. And you look like a simple man, so tell us, what, is your, what was your monthly expense? You finished tomorrow, right? What did you, what yeah, did you pay? Yeah, I probably spent a little bit more than these guys, but I, it was, uh, I think, about 1,500 pounds. 1,500 pounds. 1, pounds. Yeah. Okay, awesome. Yeah, all included. Stu, I hope you come back. Oh, likewise, I'll be back next year. <laughs> okay, let's see who's doing Muay Thai. Come here. I see a few Australian blokes. Hey, Georgie. I just, I, I just found someone who just came to Bangtao Muay Thai because of the Hickman brothers. That was the reason. Who is that? Harry from Wales. Harry from Wales. I love it. Ah. 
We're going to introduce people from Bangkok. What do we got going on on here? What is oh, this? Yeah, I like actually, it. I actually have to talk to the boss. I am introducing the people from Bangtao, showing people who is coming here, that it's not only pro fighters, not only gangsters. Guten Scheiser. Guten Scheiser, right? And what are we paying? What do you pay for months of holiday here in Bangtao? So people know a little bit what we're doing up here. We can go right to the front office and we can check those prices. Ah, you want to do that now? Yeah, great. Come on, let's, let's go. go. Why you do not have shoes on? Well, I just wanted to enter the Muay Thai mats, and you oh, don't wear shoes on Muay Thai okay, mats. Now, okay. you see me on fucking wet socks. That microphone looks good on you. Yeah, huh? So if you just come in here. So there's the front office. Who we got here? This is the front Sue, you changed your, your hair again? No, Sue, that is Anne. No, I was talking to him. I was making a joke. Yeah, he's oh, the now. new Sue. Not bad, huh? Right over me head. <laughs> Yeah, Georgie, show what we got. This is the, the pricing here. This is our all-inclusive package. <laughs> one day pass, one week, one month, and so forth, three months. Muay Thai and MMA package. Fitness package. Nice. Get them while they're hot. You hear it. Georgie, now that I'm talking to you, yes. I mean, he's living here for what, 10 years? Uh, like nine. Nine years. Yes, nine. What does someone pay... A month when they come out here and live, like not being in a hotel room, like having their own apartment. And we know people come out here for a full year to live. What do you, what yeah, do you reckon? It just depends on what your budget is. There's plenty of um, hotels that people can stay in. If you're staying here long term, I suggest you get more of an Airbnb uh, or uh, a short term rent on a house. Um, the prices vary, but you can't put a price on your health and your wealth because your health is your wealth. So what is... What is the George Hickman paying a month? Ish. When I first moved to Thailand, I had a three bedroom apartment with three other guys, and we each paid like 7,000 baht. Um, you can eat very cheap, or if you want to eat a bit more expensive, you can do that as well. Western food, Thai food. But uh, here, centralized around the gym, we have plenty of uh, accommodation, whether it be hotels, Airbnbs, or rental properties, uh, and there's plenty of food options. Obviously, we have the grill here on staff or on the cafe on site, um, and that comes, uh, you know, with our full-time chef mm -hmm. that cooks healthy Western food, healthy Thai food, not so healthy Thai food, not so healthy Western food. Or you can go around the gym. There's a lot of uh, a lot of actually good places around here. I'm sure you could actually probably speak a bit more about that rather than me. That is um, true. Uh, as I, I know what is good food. Much. But yes, there's a lot of good okay, food. Okay, no, no throw a number. If someone wants to come here for months without flight, what do they have to budget? Without flight. 1,500, uh, 2,000, 3,000? Yes, I would say you could do it pretty cheap. You could, without including the flight, uh, you could find for one month accommodation for anywhere from 5,000 baht to probably 15, 20,000 like baht. 150 to 300 dollars? Yes, you can, yeah. if you wanna go uh, low budget, you can do that. Uh, or you could go to somewhere around here in Laguna and you could stay for $2,000 a night. It just depends on your budget, but yeah. Everything is possible in Thailand. Once you get here, uh, if you're trying to save money, everything is, uh, you can do it, go the cheaper route and, and save money, so. Awesome, Georgie. Yeah, it's danke, danke, danke. Okay, now we go back to those Australian blogs we wanted to talk about. Come, come, come. Quick, quick, quick. Yo, boys. I want to talk to you. I want to talk to him. He's the, he's the most sweatiest man in the gym. Um, yes, come here with your son. I know they're hardworking guys. Yes. We want to show our viewers what kind of people come to Bang Tao Muay Thai. Yep. So you're from Australia, right? Surely am, yes. Queensland. Father and son. Yes. <laughs> you come for Muay Thai? For what do you come in fitness? Uh, a bit of, bit of both. Bit of boxing and Muay Thai and all that sort of stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so yeah. we have one interesting question. Yep. We want to tell our, our viewers, how long are you staying here? Four weeks. Four weeks. Yes. I need a week left. A week left. Yep. What do you pay without the flight? What do you pay for, for being here for a month? Accommodation, food, all in total, ish. Ish. We're very, very lucky. We are paying, you just have to give me some sums a minute, 50 times 7, 350 Australian dollars a week for accommodation uh -huh. per week. And then this brilliant facility is how much? A hundred and something dollars a week on top. So 
let's say about four hundred dollars a week, four fifty. Four hundred dollars a week. Yeah, approximately. So sixteen hundred yeah. a month, and yes. then you like a beer after. Not like only you're... on the Saturdays. <laughs> only on the Saturdays. <laughs> Saturdays. <laughs> Without telling this lovely lady behind the camera, yes, only on the Saturdays and sometimes. But the food and that's cheap is, is be and then just sensational. So if someone yeah. wants to come from Queensland, father yep. and son, copy what you do. What do they need to budget? Throw one number. What was that? What was how, so the accommodation and that, and then chuck on maximum. And this is not very, but fifty bucks a day, sixty dollars a day for food. And so give me a number. A massage. Two thousand, two and a half thousand Aussie or yeah, what? How much was it a week again for the accommodation and training? Four fifty. Yeah, so maybe for oh mate, eight hundred dollars oh, oh, oh. a week. Eight hundred dollars a week for Matt, two. To, for two. For I two reckon. Aussie yeah, dollars. Yes. Yes. Super, yes. Yeah. Once you're here, that's everything. This so four and a half thousand Aussie dollars for yes. full months of all you can. Yes, and that's a, that's a pool access room. That's dive in the water. Oh, they're living good. They're loving. You have a pool. The whole bit. <laughs> yes, and get the chain with these two people yeah, too. Yeah, yeah. So okay. Hey boys, awesome. Yes, yeah, Thanks yeah. Thank you. No worries. Yeah.